So today's just going to be a really quick tutorial to show you how I've got it to where I gain possession of the ball whenever I touch it. Uh, as you can see, it whenever I ran up to the ball and ran into it, it stuck to the player. And now it follows me around and I've got possession. Um, I can pass it. All right, so it's really simple. Uh, it's really simple. We just have this possession script that is attached to the player game object. And then on collision enter, uh, whenever we collide with the ball, uh, we are going to gain possession. In game possession, all it does is set the ball's position to our player's ball position position. Uh, so let me show you that really quick. I've got a just an empty game object just to use the transform of the ball position. This is where we want the ball to snap to whenever we collide with it. And if we look at our player script, we've got a ball position that we've drug the ball position into. So if we go back to the script, uh, we also set the parent to that ball position and we set the constraints to freeze all whenever we have possession of the ball. This prevents it from rolling away from our player or it, it just keeps the ball in place where it should be. Uh, and we also set the bull for the player to have possession. Then we swap the brains. We can ignore this. This has to do with our switching player scripts and it doesn't have to do with gaining possession of the ball. So if we go back to the editor and we run the game, we can see that whenever we run into the ball, we gain possession of it. If you made it to the end, thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Uh, if you would be so kind to give me a follow and a like, that would really help me out with YouTube's algorithm.